Well, there you have it, folks. The lazy man's way of putting a button on his pants that fell off. I tried many different designs, and I, one of the things that I found was that having this uh, one eighth of an inch uh, just to play with actually caused a problem. And also, the other problem was doing that I was actually putting a front and a back so when the two pennies would sandwich in between the cloth and the rivet would go in the middle it would actually just pressure them together and there was no way for the cloth the 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 part that actually comes over and overlaps over your button to actually fit in so what I did is I, instead of using two pennies I said well you know what um, I do have an eighth of an inch hole back here you can't see it but right where the rivet went um, I actually uh, had just an exact one eighth of an inch hole so with the actual lip being a little bit wider than the one eighth of an inch it actually caught the cloth part so there was no need to add a, a spacer or anything on the back in order to hold the the front penny on the on, on the front now one of the things about these things is that when they actually come down and this part does break off as we have here um, when the part actually does snap off I think it cuts it off what it does once it feels enough pressure but anyways um, there's like a little nub that stays right here on the on the top and I you know it's just cosmetic and I really didn't care but uh, well I did obviously <laughs> because what I ended up doing was just hammering the little nub that stuck out and I just hammered it up here nothing nothing fancy just using a hammer and it didn't break or anything and as you can see it just attaches nicely to the to the other part and although I'm just using one hand now I'm no expert in tying buttons with one hand but um, the button does does go in nicely after all just using one one um, one side so there is really no need to add a an additional part on the back and there you have it folks um, you know what would be cool if I had a coins or coin from another world uh, part of the world uh, you know, just something unique, something different. I learned a lot from this little project. and Well, I'm sharing it with the world and see what you guys think. Uh, feel free to comment and or suggest any improvements that I can do. But again, this is my own lazy way of not having to re-sew threads and threads and threads again. And, and the problem was that this, this thing kept on falling off over and over. So in order to avoid all that... I just added the penny. Thank you, folks. Have a good evening.